MTN. Everywhere you go. Project Fame! What's a feeling? Me. <laughs> African night last night. After everything you'd all put into it, the time, the energy, everything, we still came out short. For a few, they came above average. For some, they still came out short. Others replaced the skills that they had for singing for something else. Others didn't even do anything. Others were almost perfect. Everything was in line. Some of you are just very fortunate to be here, either because of votes, either because the judges just like you and want you to continue again. After the faculty probably sees your continuity and consistency, or basically because all the contestants who are never on probation just like you and they really want to compete with you. It is not a perfect world. You cannot be a perfect singer or a perfect entertainer. You can just borrow one, two, or three things. It's week seven. You all still don't get it. You know what the bad news is? You all have everything to gain and you still have everything to lose. I'm sure you're very aware of that. The sad thing is, for you guys, two more people will go this weekend. Blessing is not here any longer. Neither is David. Two more will join them. My revelation for last weekend was Roland. He fought his way through. The judges saw what they saw at the semifinals in you on eviction night. to you Roland is what were you waiting for for over five weeks 
No answer, as usual. You waited five long weeks before you discovered yourself. Have you asked yourself the question, what if the judges didn't save you? Would the faculty have saved you? Or would the other contestants who were not on probation have saved you? It's just a thought. Same thing goes for Olawale. Were you just lucky or fortunate to be saved by the other contestants? We're gonna start with the lovely- Margaret. Margaret, can you please have your vote? Okay. Mimi Ola, please reveal. Okay. Okay. Jimo, can we please have your vote? Simon, please reveal. All right, this is immaculate. A ask yourself the question, what if they didn't save you? I'm going to ask Omolaya the same question, but I'll ask him differently. Do you think that you deserve to be here? It's a question. You deserve to be here. Do you think you have worked hard enough to be here? It's another question. Is that a yes or a no? You haven't worked hard enough. When are you going to start walking harder than you have done now?
Simon, playtime is over. Are you ready to sing now? If you see me, it's evil with my hand. Making a laugh, oh. I am keeping to my culture. If you see me, it's in Uba no Buroko. Don't be surprised. That is a Mazalari, brother. If you see me, all eating down in Africa. Making a laugh, I am talking to my ancestors. Ah. If you see me, breaking Kula not in Africa. Don't be surprised. That is in my way, oh. Na 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 na. I carry my ever with the me. I carry some up for no soup. Oh. To evil my country. When I did travel, I carry some ever with the me. I carry some up for no soup. Oh. To a love a girl. When I reach my brother, I don't like their food. Oh. I don't like their food. Oh. You know, evil my country. When I reach my brother, I don't like their food. Oh. I don't think it is to. In a love a girl. I carry my ever. I begin the job, I begin the job, my brother. I carry my ever, I carry my own. I begin the job, I begin the job, my brother. You owe you more people, you owe you more people, and they are. Let me get clap for me. They say, me, I didn't do much. You give out it. You owe you more people, you owe you more people, and they are. Let me get clap for me. They say, me, I didn't do much. You give out it. Africa walk is late. They say if not so, mommy, he is committing suicide. You are committing suicide. We will call police late. How can you prove this big thing you just swallow? Say not so. Which kind of shop it is late? Hey, police late. asking you a question. Playtime is over. Personality doesn't win you the race. You need to add singing to it. And I'm still stressing it. You're not singing yet. You need to start being sincere to yourself and start facing all these people. You've got personality which a lot of them are looking for. They've got singing which you are looking for. It's just a few of you that have both balanced. Jima was just clowning on stage last night.
That song is a reggae song performed by the most talented reggae man I've ever known, Majek Fashek. And you were hopping like a kangaroo waiting to go into the operating theater. You do not understand that you need to hold on to the clutches of your dance coach. And that song is highly spiritual. If you do not get it, you will never do. Because the question is, what if you eventually get into the reggae week? How are you going to handle it? You think reggae is a joke? Reggae is soul. If you don't feel it, you can never deliver it. Never. People see beyond you performing on stage. They see miracles descend. And if you cannot be that warrior that will bring it down, it's already too late. Niniola sacrificed singing for dancing yesterday. can move finally we know but where is the singing part nowhere you were panting like a woman going into the operating theater about to have quadruplets it's a singing competition it's not a doctor's house the buffed one immaculate performed well last night and she added a bit of TV movement into her dancing.
Most places where she was choking for breath and trying to sing, she transformed that into movement. How many of you can think on your feet in a fraction of a second to get that out? Good delivery, Margaret. Despite the fact that we put you through a lot. You went right under the wire and you came out victorious. That was good. Having a wardrobe malfunction, that is none of our business. You need to make sure that everything is handled. You all need to prepare from backstage, from the academy, before you get on that stage, because anything that goes wrong from there is entirely your fault. Full stop. Project Fame! What a feeling!